think we should all just talk about sustainable energies because the growth rate that's happening in the industry on data usage or resource usage as networking is going through the roof. So it's critical that we work on multiple aspects of it. Well, one of the challenges is, is I think the fact that climate change or climate chaos is happening. It's very critical that uh, the private industry steps up to the plate to support what the governments are doing in terms of climate change. Uh, and more importantly, if I look at Canada, for us, it's floods and fires, which is interesting. You have two opposites, fire and water, uh, that are wreaking havoc in our country at different times uh, of the year. So, so uh, our vision is very simple. There's a magnificent use case for 5G to provide across multiple operators what is a seamless journey for public safety first responders. So our goal is not so much for TELUS market share, but how do we step up as an industry in Canada to get better outcomes, be it better health outcomes or better community safety outcomes. During COVID, uh, we saw a lot of work from home, or at least work from multiple locations. I don't think that was a transient stage. It's part of life. So, so if you look at the capacity that people need to be able to function remotely, uh, that, that capacity is uh, what I would say pre-pandemic time is more like 3x and 4x, going to something like 10x with bi-directional video content sharing. So our plan is very simple. We've made a, what we call a generational investment in fiber infrastructure, but we're doing the same with, with 5G, in particular with the latest mid-band spectrum that we have to provide fixed wireless access uh, in tune of 100 megabits and plus to our subscribers. But still, uh, the main, I would say what we're doing, the main go-to is fiber to the home uh, with XGS bond of 10 gig going to, depending how you go to standards, either <laughs> 25 gig or 50 gig.